Today we're going to learn how to send personalized emails in Excel without using VBA. So as you can see here, I have some data and then here I have a formula that sends the email. As an example, for this person who sold 5,000 versus a target of 4,500, so 11% above target or 500 above target, if you click here, you get a personalized email with a 2 CC, a title, and then you get his performance here. So let's see how to do this. We're going to start with the same table, but only with the basic data. So here I have the name, the email of the person, the CC, the sales, the target, and then the subject. And the subject is the same. So the first thing we're going to do is to calculate if the person is below or above his sales target. So we do equal, we open the parentheses, we do the sales minus the target over the target. We get 9% and we drag it to get it for every person. Next, we need to calculate the amount. So we do equal sales minus target so we can see if he's above or below. Next, I need to define a good and a not good body. A good body is, for example, for this person who overachieved, a not good body is for a person like this one who didn't reach his target. So we're going to write equal your performance was amazing this month. Then we say you have overachieved the target by then we put an end so we take the number from here so we say this is the number then you say and again we open double quotation space we say or space another and to add this now if you see here I'm just gonna make it a bit bigger I still have a problem. This number, this percentage is coming very long and not nice. So I need to use a formula here. So I'm going to use a text formula that transforms a value into a text with a specific format. So this is the value and then you need to select your format. So I'm going to put 0.00%, which means I'm going to have a percentage with two decimal points. So I close this. And as you can see, I get 9.09, .09, right? Again, this is a good body, but this person did not achieve it. It's fine. We're just going to drag this formula. And then you can see that I get this for every person. The not good body is a formula or a text that is going to get used when somebody doesn't reach the target. So we're going to say your performance was horrible this month you have under achieved by again same technique double quotation and we select this then we say and we write this or and and we select this percentage Again, I'm going to have this problem, so I'm going to use the text methodology. I'm going to put 0.00% in brackets or double quotation. And then you say OK. So there you go. And you can drag this. Next, I need to define what body will be used in the email. This one or this one. So in case he did well, I need this one in case he or she didn't do well. I need this one. So I'm going to say equal if this is bigger or equal than zero, then we're going to use this body. Otherwise, we use this body. So this way, let's just format it a little bit. You can see that here he gets the horrible comment. Here he'll get the amazing comment. So we drag this. Next, we need to do a final name. So if you see here, 
you get shout or pat on the back for the email name just for us to see it so we need to create this final name using again an if formula so we're gonna copy the same if formula so we go here we copy it escape we go here we say Control V and instead of this we're gonna select or we're gonna write our messages so if it's above zero it's pat on the back otherwise it is shout we just hard coded this in double quotations and then we drag this down now we're gonna write a formula with a hyperlink to be able to send the email now I advise you to write this formula step by step and test it because Excel if you have a problem it will not tell you with this formula so it's easier to debug so I'm going to say equal hyperlink, select hyperlink, then you have open parenthesis, then you have to write the to, to who are we going to send the email. So we open this double quotation and then we say mail to, two dots here, this one, and then we close this and we need to select who will receive the email so in this case it's this person John right and then we have a comma and we select the final name this after the comma it will be the name of the hyperlink so when I close the parenthesis you see I get shout I click on it you see I get my two and I get the email we go back here we need now to put the subject so to put the subject you do and open the double quotation you put a question mark subject and then you do equal then you say this is your subject right then you do enter as you can see we get the subject now next we need to do the cc so to do the cc you add another and you open the double quotations you do and inside so be careful copy it right I'm going to put this in the description so you can take the format and fix it right so you do and cc equal you do the double quotation and then you select your cc again we have to test this as you can see I get my cc next we need the body of the email same technique and double quotation and body equal you close the double quotation and you do another and and you select your final body and then you test it again so as you can see I have your performance was horrible this month you underachieve etc now if you want to go to the line here there is a trick that you need to do and I'm going to show you this one so HTML doesn't read using alt and enter to go to the line if you do it it's not going to work so what you need to do is you need to go here and then you need to do percentage 0a when you do percentage 0a it goes to the line so you can use it as many times as you want so I'm going to use it here one time percentage 0a as you can see here and I'm going to use it for this one percentage 0 a and do I do enter so as you can see it's here now if I click on my shout because I refer to those cells and this again refers to those cells as you can see it goes to the line 